right guys so here's the 10 gallon tank as you can see both Fred and Spike are doing good they just had uh, blood worms so they're full and fat um, let me zoom out real quick show you all the whole tank first before I talk about anything kind of rescaped it a little bit as you can tell from the last video all right so you should probably know what I got I got four of these boosts plants there's two of them here's these two I don't know the names of them because they were in a variety they were basically a, a variety assortment pack type areas, which what the fish store said they got them in as. And they didn't, couldn't tell what which one's what, so they just sold them for very cheap, but got them as a fraction of the price of what they normally are down here. Um, so I'll just give y'all a couple shots of it. If y'all know anything about them, maybe y'all could figure out what types they are, if they're the same type, different types. Um, I got rid of some of the rocks in here. Each one of these were actually are they're actually attached to rocks. They're white rocks, so some of them like this one doesn't really look like it's sitting on a rock, but the rocks under there. You want to say hello? He came up to my finger. That was funny. Uh, I put a couple pieces of Java moss right there, a big portion of it right there. That was on sale as well, so I jumped on that. Um, zoom out all the way show you the whole tank and I also moved all the bacopa right there in the middle some of it's doing pretty good as you can see a couple of them are going real long um, the red plant I just keep calling the red plant because it's easier to say it's the Althera Reneki or... I'll put the name on the thing again like I've been doing. Uh, they were more upright, but this guy right here loves to like jump in them. I was watching them earlier. So he kind of squishes them in the middle. As you can see, these couple in the front are pushed more towards the front. And there's this big hole in the middle. Um, but eh, no biggie. He likes them. Floating plants are doing great. Lines still hold them. A couple little duckweed over there, but no biggie. Uh, those are still doing good over there. I, I want to say they've grown a little bit, but not too sure. And in the 36 gallon, like I said, I got a couple snails, a couple nearite snails. There's one of them right there. I haven't been able to find the other one since I put them in. They'll turn up, but. They're basically the same. They had them labeled as military helmet nearites. But when I look it up, it doesn't really look like that. So if y'all know what they are, that'd be great if you could let me know what type they are. They both kind of look like that. I have a picture I'll post on the screen too. So you can see both of them. Um, other than that, Fish are doing great. Yeah, we can clear up. There we go. So they're doing good. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope y'all liked that update video on what I did. Um, hit that like button if you like this video. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed for more videos. And hit that notification bell so you can be ready for the next video. It'll let you know when the next one's out. And just thanks for watching, guys. Be ready for the next one.